Today I'm going to show you how to wind a clockwise coil, also referred to as an anti-clockwise turning by Mr. Kesh for building the MagGrav power supplies. Note the direction that the coil winds away from you in a clockwise fashion. Rule number one, to determine clockwise wind, hold the end of the coil near your eye, similar to a periscope. Then, rule number two, follow the coil wind away from your eye towards your hand. Next, I'm going to show you a very easy to see and very loose clockwise copper coil wound around a wooden rod. First, place your wire in front of the rod. Second, bring your wire behind the rod to your left. Then, bring your wire in front of the rod to your right. And finally, repeat steps 2 and 3 until your desired length of coil is reached. There is something important to note, though, about winding a clockwise coil, and it is likely the reason why Mr. Kesh has called it an anti-clockwise coil, and that is that your hand in rod will turn counterclockwise or anti-clockwise in order to wind a clockwise coil. Congratulations! You know how to wind clockwise coils, also known as Kesh's anti-clockwise turning for the MagGrav power supply. Welcome to part two, how to strip copper wire fast, easy, and cheap. First, unwind your desired length of wire. It doesn't matter if it's two feet or 72 feet. This process is easy with any length. Use your wire nippers to cut your length. Next, secure one end of the coated wire underneath the ball of your foot. It is easier if you have on a shoe. Then, you're simply going to angle and slice down toward your shoe with your trusty and hopefully very sharp utility knife. To continue to strip the rest of your wire length, trim off the plastic from the wire end you're holding in your hand. If your adorable baby bunny comes to visit you, try and pet him before he runs away. Then, split the plastic coating apart at the end in your hand. Peel plastic coating away and down toward your trusty shoe. Next, you will simply repeat angle slicing and peeling, toward your shoe of course, until all wire length is bare. Cut, peel, repeat. Once you reach the end of your wire length, you can snip off the remaining as shown here, or slice and peel the remaining length as in the beginning, or you can just pull it off. Thank you for watching Easy Clockwise Coil Winding and Easy Wire Stripping by Ari Stone Art, LLC.